I think that uh, when you're in a band with family members, it's like you automatically have this like leg up because you have that like telepathic thing. And then it's also harder for you to break up, which is, I guess, why you were so devastated when those two broke up. And so, like, yeah. I always see bands that when they have family members in it, I'm like, God damn you. It is time. Uh, Pete with Galaxy Jams reacts. Um, I picked another song. This is from a Swedish band called Detective Biron, um, which I guess loosely in Swedish translates to the Detective Agency. So this band was a huge inspiration on me. Um, they started as a busking band in Stockholm. Nice. And they have definitely evolved, which I will talk about for the video. But it's, right now it's very whimsical, kind of like Jan Tiersen Amelie soundtrack kind of sound. So this is a live television performance that they did. Reminds me of the music at the beginning of a Tim Burton movie. Yeah. I was thinking the very Tim Burton. And the sound quality is great, too. Great. And the imagery at the beginning is kind of Tim Burton esque. Uh huh. They just look like Tim Burton characters. <laughs> That's most of Sweden, I think. <laughs> and like everything's matching with the equipment and the right. shirts and stuff. Yeah. I love that. That's how a band should look. Yeah, put together, you know. Well, that's a haircut. Hey, <laughs> it's coming back. <laughs> Harsh bangs, all about it. That and the mullet. It sounds like it looks like they're playing on like little kid instruments. <laughs> yeah, that, well, that's a, that's a kind of clavier. That's a toy right. piano, and then the glockenspiel, which we have in our band. Um, like it, it's it's such a versatile instrument, and yes, it, you don't really need to mic it a lot of times. Oh, oh yeah, they're loud. Mm -hmm. and like the Ooh. the accordion is basically three instruments in one as well, like. I have an I accordion that looks just like that. Yeah. I wanted to put one in our band, but not a lot of accordion players here in the city. Alright, I'll learn. <laughs> Thank you. Get up here. <laughs> uh. I like how he's using brushes, too. That's soft sound. Yeah, you can re read the room, not like a typical drummer. Right, 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 right. Right, not like a typical drama. That noise. Like a harmonium, I think. I really like this. We only got a little bit to go. I forgot, I was so into it. I forgot to stop it. <laughs> no, uh, this is awesome. I love this kind of music. Um, it's uh, just very carnival esque, and uh, that, but yet it has those new sounds that are doing uh, with some of the synthesizer stuff in there. I love the accordion, and again, that guy's drumming is uh, he's on it. Yeah, he's no, on that. it, and even even the drum set looks a little miniature and tiny, right, and cute. Right, right, right. Look it's at like that a, kick. It's, it's like, like the smallest kick. It's like the smallest tiny. kick in the world. <laughs> you know that uh what instrument was that at the end that was like wow 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 is it was it the I accordion think, uh, it's like a synth, no that's right? I th it's like a harmonium synth basically okay, okay. that yeah. 
that tone of that was so like strange. Like wet yeah, bass I tone. loved it. I loved it. Wow. Yeah, but I love this, and it's it's very very cool. <laughs> and then so, James got that. Uh, well, if, oh sorry. Oh no, it's okay. I was just saying like, well, there's only like twenty seconds left yeah. or something. But this band is so okay. So you probably have actually seen uh, part of this band before. So a couple years ago, there was this viral hit on YouTube. It's got like 250 million views about the guy that made the marble machine that made music. Right, right. That's him. That's him on that's the left. That's him? Are you oh. kidding me? So, I remember no, that's, that. It was that's, amazing. Are you talking about like the Duke so, guy? The marble machine. Yeah. yeah. So that's Martin Mullen. And that's his brother on the accordion. So this was their first band. Oh, wow. And this, this band I love. Like it's one of my top five Um. And then they disbanded in like 2010. Like I was just genuinely like it bummed me out for a fucking week straight. Like imagine. just waking up depressed at this band because like they have like three amazing albums and very inspiring, you know, to like my songwriting. Mm -hmm. So then they were just you know quiet for a couple of years, and then that Marble Machine video came out. And I was like, oh my god, that's Martin. Mm -hmm. And then they turned into a band called Wintergarten, which the live drummer of this who replaced this bald guy, like now he's in Wintergarten, but mm -hmm. then. It got weird. Okay. I don't know if you guys have time to hear about how weird it got, but like Go for, for the last six, after the, the viral hit, he's like, I'm going to make a better marble machine. So the last six years, he's been building this other marble machine and oh. he's utilized Discord to like build different parts of it and all that oh, stuff. Wow. And then he got about 95% done. It's like this huge community on Discord. Yeah. And out of nowhere, he just is like, I'm done. I'm not, I'm not going to finish it. Oh. And then everyone was pissed because, like, everyone was, like, Everybody's Patreon invested. and, like, supporters. Know, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, like, I was paying monthly to, like, see this marble machine get made. Oh, wow. And then all of a sudden, he's, he started talking about Elon Musk and blockchain and, like, and then everyone wow. was, like, You have to buy the you, marble NFT. Are you, I was like, are you okay, dude? Like, what's going on? And he just was like, I can't do this anymore. Like, it's kind of destroyed my life. So I guess he's starting all over. But everyone's like, dude, don't, like, you're almost there. Like, Because the whole thing was... Yeah, yeah, they were yeah. gonna make it and then go on this world tour because Winter got to make like an amazing album, right? And it's beautiful, but you know he's not an engineer, but he just kind of like figured out how to do all this stuff, and right. you can tell from this band, Detective Biron, that they like had these early, you know, like that early history with it, basically where they would make their own instruments and right. they would like kind of be like MacGyver about it. So yeah, I was about to say it seems like they have that like technical interest in yeah. their like instruments, and so that makes sense. Yeah. Let's check out this little last bit of it. Yeah. Yeah. Does the rest of the music sound like this? Yes. Yes. Cool. It's, it's really beautiful and a lot of it's, it's like waltz haunting almost. Time. Very, very. I think this title translates to uh, In the Mouth of the Wolf, mm. too. Okay. Like, so it's just really whimsical and fantastical. Yeah. And, but I love the butterfly stuff that they had on. That's great. Yeah, that was yeah, awesome. Yeah, so interesting. Thank yeah. you so much for sharing. Detective Byron. Yeah, I'm going to have to check them out. And, I would like and then to Wintergarten is, is the new band. That's okay. like the, the, the is that bigger with band. Is both of the brothers too? No, that's, that's the other weird thing is that like they, they are brothers and they're so similar, but I think they have like a falling out. Oh. And I'm they're like, it's somebody that's like so close with their brother. I'm like, what? Like that bums me the fuck right, out. Like right. get back together, make music. Because especially like with what he's doing on his YouTube channel, like he's such a big YouTuber now, like because he's making this machine. And I was like, your brother could help. Like I'm right. just <laughs> shipping, I'm shipping them back together. Get over it. So. Make up. Yeah, he's like, you told me we were going to Wendy's. Like, nope, we're hanging out with your brother. <laughs> Whatever <laughs> Swedish equivalent of Wendy's is. Yeah, Vandy's. Wendy's. <laughs> there it is. Wendy's, yeah. Yeah, and Oops, yeah. um, you know, I think that uh, when you're in a band with family members, it's like you automatically have this like leg up because you have that like telepathic thing. And then it's also harder for you to break up, which is, I guess, why you were so devastated when those two broke up. And so, like, yeah. I always see bands that when they have family members in it, I'm like, God damn you. you know? That's what's crazy <laughs> is that like that song that you just heard, there's there's a video of, of the other guy, the accordion player. He made like a one man band kind of thing. Like he has a big oh. kick drum on his back and he kind of like shifts around to like kick it with like little levers and stuff. Mm -hmm. He's playing that song on the streets of Stockholm by himself. And it's like one of the saddest things I've seen. It's not bad. It's just like, oh my God, I know that song. I love that song. 
but now right. it's just you playing it alone. So, right, like yeah. on the street corner for a dollar. Yeah. Right. Well, I mean, at least he's keeping it alive. Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> hey, guys, this is Mike with Galaxy Jams Reacts. Thanks for watching that React video. If you want us to listen to your favorite song, be sure to message us on Facebook. We may include it in our next video. We also do a live improv jam stream. Be sure to check out the schedule on our socials of when we're going to stream next. And if you want to hear what we sound like, just give us 30 seconds.